What's going on guys? Back with another video. Today we are heading to another place to go take uh, product shots of food for Uber Eats. We're gonna be there in about like 18 minutes or so. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys when I get there. We're in this place right now. This is the first dish. It looks like it's just a salad. They pretty much just have like a bunch of pre-made meals. I'm gonna be doing like seven dishes and then one main hero shot with all the dishes on the little platform. Brought an extra one just in case we need a bigger surface area. But these are smaller dishes, so it shouldn't take up too much real estate. Let's see how it's looking on the camera. There's not really a whole lot of room to maneuver. Some big fridges. It has to be the same camera angle. Okay. Looks pretty good to me. Okay, so we just finished up the first dish. Let's just put this to the side. This is the second one. Let's make sure that it's all... Is this done? Yeah, that one's done. We're gonna need that, like one of the dishes, because we have to do a master shot of all the dishes at the end. So we've done two so far. On the wood? Let's slide it a little bit more this way though. Like that? Yeah. That works? Yeah. Okay. okay, so we've done three dishes so far. We did this one, we did that one, and that one. So we have four more. Take a look. Oh. So they're going to be cropping out the, no, the sides. Okay. Yeah. Mm. Yeah? Looks yeah. good? See the spicy egg? Yeah. Ready for the next one? Yeah. So we've done one, two, three, four, five, six. And then the last one? Yeah. Let's try to do it this way. So. Like that? You sure you don't want to be like the other one? I'm trying. I don't want to see it through the camera. Who's trying to It would probably have to be like, kind of like... Well, I'm thinking of something. Like that. Sorry. That that looks good. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Good. Oop. We have to set right? Yeah. Okay. The last picture I should just back up as much as I can, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, who should I? Typically, you want to have one focal dish, and then you want to put smaller plates around it. One what? One focal main dish, and then you want to put like smaller plates what around it. However, you would like put to do it. These in the middle, and then in the 
inside with it. Let's do the last one. You're leaving all the lights, right? Yeah, we need we need all the lights and everything. Yeah. Typically we put like one main dish right in the center. And then we'll have like little dish. Okay. So yeah, however you would like to do. So what I will do. So this is gonna be the center where it's gonna be. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna readjust all the uh, so lighting. The center? Yes, yeah, so sir. Let's do this. One second. Okay, give it the left hand side. I'm like in the. Sorry, talking Yiddish. No, you're 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 good. Give it. Give it the. What's that? Something. So, like a roll in a long container. So much there. So that just concludes the shoot. We pretty much just finished up with the last shot. No, I'm good, sir. Thank you. I truly appreciate. So that went pretty well. Simple execution. Just packing up the gear now. All right, so we're in the car now. Not really bad at all. Not bad. 30 minute drive, 40 minute shoot, including setup and breakdown. Can't complain about that. This was a lot more enjoyable to do than the uh, place I did yesterday, which was a pizzeria. This place seemed like it was a little easier just because it was a lot more like pre-made meals. The other place they had to like cook the specific meals and stuff. So I had to sit around, wait, you know, at least in half an hour for the meals to be made and all of that. And then like I had to quickly do it because we didn't want them to get dried out or, you know, this was just a lot easier. Simple execution. Hopefully more will be like this because that'd be amazing. But um, yeah, so just driving home right now and uh, I'll uh, see you guys when I get home, all right? Bruce. All right, so we're back. Looking at the photos. They're starting to look pretty good. I don't have to do any of the editing as the company does the, most of the editing for me. So I shot them in RAW and as well as JPEG, but they just want me to keep the RAW images just in case, but they just want me to send over the JPEGs. I mean, like, that looks pretty good. They're gonna crop it a little bit. And this is like the hero shot of just like all their products. Yeah, really simple execution. I have two more of these tomorrow, so I'm thinking of uh, just continuing the series and just showing you guys the behind the scenes experience of uh, an Uber Eats photo shoot. If that's something that you're interested in, definitely let me know.